Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is a quick look at one of the uh, features of the April 2019 update. And this new version that is going to um, arrive in April 2019, there's a separation from Cortana and from Search. Cortana has its own little ring and Search now is its own little magnifying glass icon in the taskbar. So Search, of course, is more powerful than ever in the new version of Windows 10. It is, first of all, a le the layout is a little more interesting, easier to go through and to flow through. Some people find that it's a waste of space, but a lot of people that have um, high problems will tell you that they might actually find it better like this because it is easier to have the information you want. You've got your top apps that appear at the top. So for example, what I've used recently, Chrome, PowerPoint, Edge, File Explorer. You've got your recent activities, which means that you'll have a certain number of um, places that you'll be able to check out here. And that, that you've been, for example, or you know apps that you've used. But not just that, it tells you actually even what file you open with these apps, which is pretty cool. Of course, you can click on the top for apps. You'll see the recent apps that have been used. Documents, if you are using a lot of documents, you'll have some of them showing up. If not, well, you will have, of course, uh, the different things that you might search. So for example, here I put, just put Messenger, which is a, uh, a publication that I um, actually have an article in. And you see here all the different um, documents. And it's really fast. As you see, it's, the search is really, really, really fast. Um, if I type Spectrum, you go have other things that show up. It's extremely fast, and it's extremely good. It's better than ever, actually. You can search through emails. If you are using uh, the mail app, you'll be able to get an email from there. The web, you can search on the web directly from here. And of course, you can do different things, folders, music, people, and so on. Of course, on the upper right corner, there's three little dots. You have the different options and indexing options, including the manage accounts, because all of this is synchronized. You gotta remember this, it's very important to understand that. So a new and improved search that is really good, and of course you can search for your favorite apps. So for example, um, one of the apps that I use very often for streaming Wirecast, I just type the name and you see it actually tells you Wirecast. Uh, desktop app, you can open, run as administrator, open the file location, and so on. It is very, very cool, and uh, it's always very nice to have these um, appear very, very fast. Um, often one of the examples that I show uh, when I um, do my videos, you know, how to know your uh, Windows command, you can actually search just for the command winver, run command, run as administrator. You want to have your uh, command line, well, you can just type CMD or command and you'll have command prompt and you can run it as administrator from here. So it's really, really a nice and improved search. It's very powerful. It searches within documents also. That means if you have a document in your or a PDF in your computer and there's a specific phrase or word that you're searching for where it is, it will search within documents also, which is very, very nice. So um, it's one of those things that uh, you really, really um, should use regularly because, I mean, the search in Windows 10 is very, very nice and very powerful. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.